Well, I come from a very technical background. Uh, I have a uh, bachelor's in electronics and communications engineering. Uh, I have a master's in robotics. Uh, my uh, most of my uh, industrial experience or professional experience is in the field of industrial automation. So uh, I'm a big fan of anime. I spend most of my time watching anime. Uh, uh, I'm an avid reader as well. Uh, I write uh, well, mostly pro poetry, and um, I enjoy painting a lot. And um, I the put in cooking or culinary thing, uh, something nice to eat, and I'm sorted. Hmm, very difficult choice. Usually, I go with Vincent Van Gogh because I have tried uh, recreating Starry Nights, but I would have to say Banksy. <laughs> I enjoy both actually. Uh, Indian, savory, French, sweet. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, I do believe that robotics is like the future of uh, humanity. I, I see robotics as the path that humanity usually goes towards. So uh, even uh, in today's life, robotics gives a solution to uh, lots of problems, and it every time it gives us such innovative solutions, it is. A system that is so intricate and so elegant. Aha, that is a difficult question. I say I would have to say that it is a two-way tie between the FT2J and the uh, Easy Wheel SWD or Safety Wheel Drive. The FT2J because it is an all-round awesome product because it integrates a PLC and a HMI into a single display unit and it results in a lot of cost savings to the customer with respect to the amount of space it saves, the price it saves, and uh, the power savings as well. The SWD, because it is such an innovative product, owing to the fact that you only need two wheels to build an AGV. Me personally, I have built an AGV and I know how difficult it is to build one, but this product cuts the uh, time required, the skill that is required, um, the kind of integration, the bulky hardware that goes beyond building an AGV and it all puts it into two wheels, that's it. Motorcycle, always. I would have to say the ISO 3691 because uh, it is the industrial safety standards that um, dictate the safety uh, rules uh, or regulations for robots, cobots, AGVs and AMRs and um, the latest uh, revision that is set to release uh, this year will make a lot of products uh, mandatory such as the SE2L safety laser scanner, the E30 BK1 safety 8 switch uh, to be on the system to be completely mandatory to make it completely safe. Well, uh, I would have to say both automation and safety go hand in hand when it comes to an industrial setup. But um, there can be a safety without automation, but um, there is no automation without safety. So I would have to say safety. The most interesting product that is set to release, I would have to say the SX8R remote coupler that is set to release later in the year. I uh, say this is the most interesting one because uh, I believe that there is a lot of demand for remote IOs in the industry currently and this product caters to that need. You know, would be the inclusion of SE2L in Fanuc's uh, Cobot ecosystem. The uh, project was to test the compatibility of uh, the SE2L with the Fanuc uh, CRX range of Cobots and the end result was a mutual collaboration and a mutual representation uh, between two well-established companies. Uh, <laughs> I uh, find that I enjoy comedy movies a lot in movie genres. Uh, you know how first the comedy makes you laugh and then you cry about the missing romance in life? Perfect. Perfectly balanced, just as everything should be. No real preference. I go with the story and the acting rather than the place of origin. Yeah, when nobody's watching, yeah. <laughs> <laughs>